Today we have brought you the latest Tesla news. Tesla Semi Order Announced by Sustainable Food Service Product Company. Tesla Model Y Captures I as Top Safety Pick Plus Award. Tesla Model Y is spotted at Gigafactory Berlin, but production approval still uncertain. And, Tesla Model 3 and Y owners with new headlights get extra bonus in light show holiday update. Let's get into all the details. So let's get started. The Tesla Semi's customer deliveries are yet to begin, but the Class 8 all-electric truck continues to attract new customers. One of the most recent is California-based Carrot Packaging, a manufacturer of environmentally friendly disposable food service products, which recently announced that it had ordered 10 Tesla Semis for its fleet. The Tesla Semi order is part of Carrot's plans to expand its logistic services business in the United States, as per a press release from the company. So far, Carrot operates a fleet of 86 trucks and trailers. The company also provides third-party logistic services to about 100 of its customers in California. The addition of the Tesla Semi to Carrot's fleet comes at an opportune time for the company. This is due to the food service packaging manufacturer's plans to expand its logistic offerings geographically from its current distribution centers in Texas, New Jersey, and South Carolina. Carrot also has plans to expand its operations in California. Alan Yu, Carrot Packaging's chairman and chief executive officer, expressed his excitement about the company's Tesla Semi orders. We are excited to incorporate alternative fuel trucks into our fleet. This purchase represents our commitment to continue investing in environmentally friendly solutions. Adding to Carrot Packaging's competitive advantage and the company's distinguishing characteristics, we are pleased to offer additional 3PL services to new and existing customers, particularly during the current supply chain environment, the executive said. While the start of the Tesla Semi's customer deliveries has been delayed, the electric vehicle maker has made a lot of progress with the Class 8 all-electric truck. The Tesla Semi is expected to be equipped with the company's 4680 battery cells, and it has been announced to have a range of 500 miles per charge. Similar to other vehicles in Tesla's lineup, the Semi is also expected to be equipped with bleeding-edge features, effectively making it one of the safest and advanced Class 8 truck on the road. Moving to the next update, Tesla Model Y captures IIHS Top Safety Pick Plus Award. The 2021-22 Tesla Model Y has captured the Top Safety Pick Plus Award from the Insurance Institute for Highway Safety. Only the most worthy vehicles are labeled with the Top Safety Pick Plus label. The Model Y qualified for the elusive label by earning top marks in each of the IIHS's six crashworthiness evaluations, including the driver side small overlap front, passenger side small overlap front, moderate overlap front, original side, roof strength, and head restraint tests, the agency said. The award only applies to Model Ys built after April 2021. IIHS spokesman Joe Young told Teslarati that Model Y vehicles manufactured before May 2021 do not qualify for the Top Safety Pick Plus award because the agency did not test the car's front crash prevention rating as it did not have access to a vehicle built before this date. Additionally, Tesla transitioned from a camera and radar-based system to Tesla Vision, the camera-only system that Tesla will utilize for its self-driving projects moving forward. The only Model Y vehicles permitted to have the rating were built after April 2021. The Model Y received top marks for each of its crashworthiness tests, and the performance trim of the all-electric crossover also captured a good rating for its headlights. The long-range variant held a slightly lower acceptable rating for its front beams, as it had some glare, a characteristic the performance variant lacked, which resulted in a higher rating. The Model Y now joins its sibling vehicle, the Model 3, on the top safety pick plus list. Tesla owns two of the several EV spots to appear on the list. Other EVs that made the cut are the Volkswagen ID4, also receiving good ratings across each category, earning it a spot on the highly exclusive list for only the safest vehicles available to consumers. 
Additionally, the Audi e-tron Sportback and regular four-door models also received the top safety pick plus rating. Moving to the next update, Tesla Model Y spotted at Gigafactory Berlin, but production approval still uncertain. Several Tesla Model Y vehicles have been spotted at Gigafactory Berlin. Production has been expected to start any day, but official environmental approval is still uncertain. Over the last year, Tesla has run into a lot of red tape while trying to get approval to start production at Gigafactory Berlin, a giant new factory located near Berlin and Brandenburg. Most recently, environmental groups had managed to obtain an extension of the public commentary period for the project, which delayed approval for another month. The new period concluded last month, and Tesla has been rumored to be on the verge of approval, but it has yet to happen. The Ministry for the Environment has now confirmed that it is still reviewing the comments and that Tesla apparently hasn't completed all the documentation needed for the approval. Brandenburg's Environment Minister, Axel Vogel, echoed similar comments about some documents or reports missing in order to issue official approval. While several government officials commented on the project, no one wanted to bring forward a timeline for the environmental approval. In the meantime, Tesla appears to be making progress at the plant, with several Model Y bodies and even full vehicles spotted in a recent drone flyover. The good news is, Tesla has not been sitting idly by while they wait. According to information coming out of Germany, the automaker has been fine-tuning their production lines and has already built more than 240 Model Ys at the new factory. The information comes from a source who spoke with Tesla enthusiast Sawyer Merritt, who said, the vehicles are being used for a variety of purposes. Some of the cars are for crash tests, weather toughness and weather tightness stuff, and some are for testing the recycling processes in the factory. Some of those already built are being used for internal transportation inside the factory. The source also revealed more information about specific details of the Model Ys that will be built at Giga Berlin. It will feature front and rear castings, structural pack with 4680 cells, will launch later in 2022, and 12 volt Li ion batteries. First cars will be black or white only, while Giga Berlin perfects three new paint colors. After several delays, Tesla was hoping to get the green light to begin production this month. As we get closer to the end of the year, this is beginning to look less and less likely. However, when that final approval comes, Tesla is ready to fire up the production lines and could begin delivering cars in as little as two weeks, Merritt said. Moving to the last update, Tesla Model 3 and Y owners with new headlights get extra bonus in light show holiday update. Tesla owners will be getting an early Christmas gift with the impending release of the 2021 edition of the holiday software update. The 2021.44.25 release notes, leaked recently, showing, one of the features, will be a choreographed light show, similar to the Easter egg, that has been included in the Model X for a number of years. But there will be an extra bonus exclusively for owners, that have a Model 3 or Model Y, with the latest headlights. A source has told Drive Tesla, the light show will project the word Tesla, from each headlight. Tesla already showed off this bonus feature during the Giga Berlin Brandenburg County Fair in early October. Here is a video of the light show in action on a Model 3 performance, but during the day. The new headlights have been included in the long range and performance variants of the Model 3 since last year and only on the Model Y performance starting earlier this year. If you are wondering if you have them, the new version includes a round bulb on the outer edge of the headlight housing. That's it for now. So what are your thoughts about this? Let us know in the comments. Stay tuned at the Electric Arena for all the latest Tesla and electric vehicle news.